John, we're still reeling in from a political bombshell dropped on us today, Mayor Daley resigning. Did you see this coming at all? No, I thought he would run one more term. He's 68 years old and uh, he seems to be in good health, although his wife's not in good health and I think most everybody thought he would go one more round. Uh, he has been the mayor 21 years though and he has run the city for 21 years. He epitomized the city for a whole generation of people and I can understand that uh, after two decades you might think you won't do something different. Is there a concern, uh, concern <clears throat> are you concerned at all about uh, what this could mean for the city? I mean like you said this is a man that a lot of people grew up studying almost and now the city being in the shape that it is, financially at least, uh, is this a good thing or bad thing that you see for the city of Chicago? Well, these are difficult times for cities and for states. Their budgets are all in trouble. They've got all kinds of problems that uh, they're having to manage, and the national recession has certainly hurt income on both city and state level. Chicago, like everyone else, is facing a deficit that they're going to have to manage. Um, Nobody's irreplaceable. There'll be somebody else elected mayor of Chicago and life goes on. Uh, but this is the last of the dailies. I doubt that there will be a daily brother step up. And as far as we know, there's no third generation of daily children out there. So in the sense that Richard J. Daly ran the city for so long, and now Richard M. Daly ran the city for so long, uh, it is, as the phrase goes, truly the end of an era. Is it fair to really compare uh, Richard M. Daly to his father, Richard J. Daly? A lot of people, particularly downstate, I think, still see uh, the current Mayor Daly as the political boss that his father was. Is that a fair comparison? I think not. I think times are so much more difficult and the ability to manage problems are, is so much more limited uh, that you really can't compare the two. Richard J. Daley had the luxury of being Cook County Democratic Party chairman. Uh, he was the boss of the machine. While the machine's not entirely gone, it's certainly not what it was under the father, and it's just much more difficult to manage the city today. If you're uh, a major player in the Illinois Democratic Party right now, Speaker Madigan, Joe Barrios, uh, Rahm Emanuel even. What are, what, how, are you, how would you be taking today's news? Are you happy? Are you relieved? Are you sad to see the, bot, the man go? Well, they all have different relationships with the mayor, and I can't pretend to know all those personal relationships. I think the Democrats won't be highly concerned because uh, a Democrat will be elected mayor of the city. It's mm -hmm. just a question of which Democrat and everybody will be out choosing upsides and building coalitions very rapidly. Of course, Rahm Emanuel has said that uh, he wants to be mayor someday, but he wouldn't run against Daley. Now he's got the shot. I wouldn't at all be surprised to see him come back and run for it. Uh, David Hoffman, who ran for U.S. Senator, uh, worked for the city before and was a reformer. He has said that he's interested. Uh, Houlihan, who is now the assessor, uh, has said, James Houlihan, has said that he's definitely running. Lots of talk about Jesse Jackson, Jr., uh, certainly a possibility from the African-American community right there. Do you see Richard M. Daley playing, uh, still being a, a major player in politics, him going out and endorsing candidates or knocking on doors or? I doubt it. He won't knock on any doors. I doubt that he endorses a, a candidate in certainly in the primary. He might endorse someone in the general election, but we're talking next spring, the primary in February, general election in April, I believe. So uh, not before next April, if then. If, if a, the, as you said, and it's hard to disagree with you, that a Democrat will be elected mayor of the city of Chicago. Uh, would it be in their interest to draw connections to Mayor Daley, or not, not so wise? Uh, everybody wants to be uh, their own person. Uh, they want to stand on their own. Uh, some of them, not all of them, uh, would probably welcome some help uh, behind the scenes from Daley's organization and people if not from the mayor himself. Uh, but most of them uh, will try to define themselves as independent. John, we'll see where it goes. Thank you very much for talking. It's going to be interesting.